So, um, my last video was kind of cut off on my mom being like, hey, family pet name that you are referred by. And then trying to talk to me about shit. Anyways, so on Wednesday. On Wednesday, econ quiz. English paper due. It's got, like, it's ridiculous. I don't want to write this shit. I'm totally going to bullshit it, but that's, like, classic loss. <laughs> um, oh, yeah, and then I have to go first in songwriting because um, somebody two times ago uh, didn't go because her voice was fucked up because she's in the current production. Well, actually, it ended the day, but whatever. Um, she's in the current production of um, Phantom of the Opera, which uh, my school is putting on right now, and they put a shitload of effort in, and it was really impressive. Except I never got to see it, so that was disappointing. Hopefully somebody filmed it. I'll get to see it later or something. Um, anyways, she fucked up her voice, couldn't go on the day that she signed up for, which you're not supposed to, um, like, go another day. Like, that's not something you do, especially if you're there. And so she ended up going, uh, first today, and so I have to go first fucking next time, and I'm gonna fucking freak out because holy fuck. At least I got somebody to play, um, guitar for me. She's my transgender friend! Well, one of them. There are actually two gen transgender people in that class. I find very interesting. There's Freya, who used to be... I don't even fucking remember what her name was. Patty. Um, I've gotten really used to it. And then there's Alec, who used to be Allison. Um, yes. And then after that, oh yeah, after that I have guard, and guard's just gonna be a shithole because we've got a competition this Saturday, which I wish you could come to because I like taking my girlfriends to my guard competitions because I've done that before and it's really fun. And, um, God, when they make pet admit patients, they like scare the fuck out of her because she's really shy. And Julianne's mother, who, like, you'd never expect to be as tolerant as she is because Julianne's just, like, really innocent and stuff. And they, like, she seems like she was raised really, really Christian sometimes. And her mom came up behind us. <laughs> she goes, is this your significant other? And I was like, yes, please don't freak her out. Like, she was really, she was like, she's, oh, it was hilarious. Um, like, she was already really intimidated by the fact she was meeting, like, half of my friends. And then this woman, she's like, ah, I'm here, like a kraken from the city. Not really. It was pretty funny. Also, wait, do you like my bruise? Oh, shut the fuck up. Um, Rick! I can whistle, I promise. Now this is a terrible example. There we go. Can you wave? Um, but then I guess at least after Wednesday, like after the school day's over anyways, I get to see my dad, so that's good. Because I see him every Wednesday on every Saturday. Yeah. And I sleep over at his house on Saturdays. Except technically I'm supposed to sleep over at his house on Wednesday and technically I'm also supposed to sleep over at his house on Sunday. Um, but we are going against that court order. <laughs> technically. Um, but like it works better for everyone because like if I were at my dad's house on Sunday he'd have to drive me to school in the morning and that would suck oh also on Thursday Thursday is gonna be awesome because I like oh my god late starts on Thursday are literally like the best thing that ever happened ever and because 
I got a late start this Thursday, and then, and then, I have two art classes in a row, lunch, German, which is the easiest fucking class ever, plus, oh, well, actually, we have got a test, but I know all the, like, she, she's quizzing us on all these words we already know, it's awesome. Um, and then after that, I have robotics, which is also, like, the easiest thing, except now we're building a Rube Goldberg machine, which is supposed to crack an egg and separate the yolk from the egg. Like, for, you separate the yolk from the white, rather. And, holy fuck. Like, last time we spent the entire time planning it, well, actually, the time before that, he told us to plan it, and we were really unrealistic about it. Like, we used, like, a boy in our class as fuel to, like, burn him, to boil some water, to power a wind turbine, or no, to power, like, a wind thing that, like, powered something else, that melted something, like, melted some metal that set off this liquid nitrogen that froze the egg, and then we cracked it, and then we split it. It was weird. It was stupid. It was hilarious. <laughs> my favorite part was the part that I got to draw this guy on fire, and he was like, ah, my birds, because he's really obsessed with birds. It was really funny. <laughs> Um, and, but last time we spent the entire fucking time just arguing. Also, yes, you're gonna get to see me move. I have a shelf here. I'm not sure you can actually see it. Of things that I am sending to you. So sorry, you're gonna be excited about that. I should probably end this video right now because it's getting to be seven minutes and it's going to take like literally fucking hours to upload. So, bye, Laura. <laughs>